my name is Grace. Today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is God's Wonderful Gift. The Holy Spirit comes. Let's read. Jews from all over the world were in Jerusalem for the feast of Pentecost. Jesus' followers were there too. They gathered together, waiting for the gift Jesus has promised them. So, Jerusalem for all over the world were in uh, Jews were in Jerusalem because of the feast, and also Jesus' followers were there, and they were waiting for the gift that Jesus has promised for them. In the middle of the feast, God's gift arrived. It began with a sound, a sound like a howling wind that filled the house house where, where they were waiting. In the middle of the feast, God's gift arrived, and it began with a sound. By hauling winds that fill the house. Question Jesus' followers were waiting in Jerusalem for the gift he had promised to send them. True. Next, something that looked like fire settles on each one of them. Then God's Holy Spirit filled everyone in the room, and He gave them power to speak different languages. Language. So next, something that looked like a fire settled on each of each one of them, and then God's Holy Spirit filled everyone in the room, and the. Holy Spirit gave the power to speak different language. Oh, I wish I can have that power. <laughs> Jews from other parts of the world heard them and were amazed. These people are speaking our language. They said and telling us about the wonderful things God had done. So Jews from other parts of the world heard that they can speak in their language and they were amazed because there were another country people were speaking their language. This is God's gift, Peter, Peter explained. It was promised long ago. It comes to us through Jesus, the Messiah. You sacrifice him, but God brought him back to life. So Peter said this is God's gift. And Peter explained that it was promised long ago. And you sacrificed him, but God brought him back to life. Jesus. <laughs> Question: Were Jews from other parts of the world amazed to find the disciples speaking their language? Language? Yes. What should we do? The people are sadly turn away from evil, said Peter. Believe in Jesus Christ. He will forgive you your sins and give you his Holy Spirit. So they were they asked what should we do? And Peter told them, Turn away from evil and believe in Jesus Christ. 
then he will forgive you and your sins and give you his Holy Spirit. We should turn away from evil and believe in Jesus Christ. <laughs> On that day, 3,000 people were baptized. They were just the first of many people who would come to trust in Jesus as their savior. And on that day, 3,000 people were baptized. And that was... Uh, they were just the first of many people who would come to Jesus. Um. Question How did the people show their face after they repented and believe in Jesus? Number one, pray. Number two, um, I don't know what he's doing. Maybe tell. Maybe um, telling them about Jesus Christ to another people. And number three, baptized. Number three was the correct answer. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yesterday, I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy it? And next time, I'll read another good story. Then, let's see you next time. Bye.